Hi YouTube, it's Candy, aka Candy Sweet Enough. I haven't made a video in a long time, so I'm coming to you with an update and um, a response to a video that I just watched. First of all, really quickly, let me just do my update. Um, I am down to 146 pounds, so that is 200. I mean, 200, 114 pounds total that I've lost. It went from a size 20 and now I'm down to a size 4 and actually the pants that I'm wearing right now are size 2. I have about 4 pairs, of, no, 6 pairs of size 2's that fit. Not every size 2 fits me by any means. Not every size 4 fits me, some size 6, but um, I'm sitting around that area. Um, and that brings me to the response. Um, Amal CPHT made a video, and she was saying that, um, and this was a while back, but I had just been told about it. Um, she was saying that her goal is a size 10, and that um, seeing people get to size 4 or under uh, makes her feel like she should question her goal. When I started, that was my goal, was a size 10. I figured that if I got to a size 10, I'd be happy. I had never been below a 14. And, you know, like in high school, I was the 14. And I could look around at my friends and look around at my family or whatever and look at somebody that was a size 10 and say that's where I wanted to be. And I thought for sure that my bone structure, that I was never going to get lower, that I'd look sick and everything like that. Then I got to a 10, and I was ecstatic, don't get me wrong. I bought like 10 pairs of jeans. I was going crazy, and I hit it really fast. And I was just awestruck at the fact that it happened. And I wasn't intentionally really working hard at trying to get lower than that. And yet... When I looked at myself at a size 10, I became a little bit panicked because the reason that I had my surgery was to stay away from diabetes. And I worried that there was still quite a bit of weight and I didn't want my diabetes to come back. So I continued to lose. And my weight now, once I got to goal, which was 160, I never really tried to lose any more weight. Uh, the getting down to 146 has a lot to do with stress. Um, but I'm happy. I'm really happy where I'm at. Uh, I have a bad pooch right above my belly button. But I think that if I had plastics done, it would probably go away. Um, I I'm, I'm happy with how I look. I never expected to be here. This was not my goal. But I seriously look at all of my friends that are size 10s and I think that I look like that. I don't think I look like a 2 or a 4. I think I look like a 10. And I think that all of us have different bodies and that some bodies need to be at a size 10. It just depends on your structure and everything like that. So I think that trying to... Honestly, I don't even think that people should set a size goal. I mean, because you don't know. Because I wasted money. I thought that my size goal was going to be a 10. And it ended up not being where I should be. And so it, it, it's, it's one of those things where your body's going to stop when it's ready. And I think that it's unfair for people to set goals for themselves like that. Because um, you never know. I mean, some I know people who look fabulous at a 14. Um, and Chantry, I think that she looks fabulous right now. She doesn't even need to lose any more. To me, I look exactly like her. Um, it's, it's just a strange perception thing. And, and, you know, we just need to get used to it. It's really, really hard. Um, 
everything's a mess, but let me see if I can do a body shot. <sighs> okay. So, this is me in a pair size twos. I have, I'm wearing like a slim wear thing right now. And, um, you know, I wore a baggy shirt because these are extremely low rise pants. But, um, I'm happy. I'm happy with the way my legs look. Um, my arms. <sighs> We put, somebody made a comment the other day about it's weird not seeing me in the computer room anymore. Seeing me in here. Um, my arms are kind of hangy, but overall, um, I'm fairly happy with them. Um, those of you that are friends with me on Facebook, if you would like to find me, I'm under Candy is sweet, or Candy Sweet Enough. Um, I was Princess Leia for Halloween, and I think I looked amazing in my costume. I was really happy. I, I wore some pressions that came, you know, down lower and they tucked in my arms and everything like that. And I looked thin. Um, I am starting to get the don't lose any more comments and, you know, I don't think that I look unhealthy though. Um, and, I, and, and please, you guys be honest with me and tell me. Do you think I look healthy at this size? This is where I'm happy. This is where I want to be. Um, I'm extremely happy with this size now. But do you think that I do look unhealthy and everything like that? I, I don't know. I. It's hard for me to really figure um, because I wasn't expecting this. this. This wasn't my goal. This wasn't where I wanted it to be. So, um, I wanted to put that out there and I wanted you guys to think about the fact that you should not maybe set size goals because you never know. I think that we are all made extremely different, extremely different, and you've got to be where you're happy. For me, this is where I'm happy. Um, I think that you see about as much neck on me as you do on Chantry and she says that right now she's at a size 14 I think that we look alike so I just wanted to put that out there okay um anyways I always say I'll try to make more videos and I keep on forgetting um I'm going to Texas not tomorrow but the day after I'm going to do the Walk for Obesity, and I'm going to the OAC um, convention. I'm very excited about it. And um, so maybe I'll make a video there. I need to. So that's it. Thanks, guys. Bye.